So therefore, if you profane that tool, which was specifically endowed to man to address the objective of creation, which is the spiritual perfection of the Jew of the world, to be able to have a relation with HaKadosh Baruch Hu, Barazi Yitzhak Barazi Torah Tavlin, the only way we can be spiritualized to incapacitate the evil inclination is only through the study of Torah. We have to express it, we have to verbalize it. So if one takes that spiritual tool which has unending reaching ability and we profane it, and it's called profaning, because you took something which is the ultimate of being sacred and you profaned it by violating it, the liability is catastrophic. So if one uses his power of speech to speak Lashon Ara, to speak negatively about another person, which we'll discuss later, how many positive negative commandments. One is in violation. Besides the provision of speaking, Lashon Ara, speaking words which are negative, which have no constructive value. Besides that, what have we done? We've taken the most sacred tool, which is Talmud Turk and Egetkulam, which it brings Torah, which is the objective of creation, which allows existence to meet its purpose. And we actually, we profane it.